Wait, what? Hold on, what? Wait, what? Hold, what? No, it can't be. It can't be. It can't be. That's right, guys. Welcome back to my Pokemon Ruby walkthrough. It's been so freaking long. Holy map, holy cow, guys. The last episode I uploaded of my Pokemon Ruby walkthrough was September 10th, 2011. And... Today is March 11th, 2012. It's been months. So the reason why, guys, you guys probably know if you've watched, you know, if, if you've watched um, my whole, like, the entire walkthrough, my Pokemon Ruby walkthrough so far, um, that after I made part 6, like, literally, literally a day after I, I uh, uploaded part 6, actually not uploaded, sorry, made part 6, um, my computer just randomly, yeah, it, it, um, uh, it crashed because of the hard drive, so I'm going to be careful not to lose the hard drive, because if I lose the hard drive this time, well, I'm not going to be able to use a computer at all, and that means no more YouTube videos, so, yeah, I'm going to be careful, but, yeah, so it's fixed, so I got, so, it's not the exact same file, obviously, because when your computer crashes, you lose all your, like, downloads and stuff, but, see, I downloaded Pokemon Ruby again, and I got the, like, emulator, and I got the ROM, stuff like that, and I got, I, you know, I, Chose the same starter, which was Mudkip. It was the same gender. I got all the same Pokemon, same levels, same gender. I seriously, like, it, I didn't, like, about 45 minutes. Um, I got C Dot, which was a female. Um, I got Zigzagoon, which was a male. Zigzagoon was level 6, C Dot was level 10, and Mudkip was level 14. Um, so yeah, it's pretty awesome. Um, yeah, I can't believe it. So yeah, it's like, I don't have the same ID and everything, but yeah, same Pokemon, same gender, same levels, same character, same name, everything. Um, but yeah, this is awesome. Like, wow. So yeah, if you guys do not remember the last episode, uh, I was here standing in front of the gym. Yeah, yeah. So let's, so let's go inside. This is a rock type gym, like every other game. Um, well, except for the you know, except for the Unibar Unibar region and the Jota region. But yeah. So the Pokemon in front of my party is Zigzagoon. I'm pretty sure. Yes, it is. Okay. Um, I think. Hmm, blah, 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 blah. Let's go with C dot for this one. Uh, I don't know why. Zigzagoon is just gonna be like left out of my party. But um, yeah. I don't know how, but I'm gonna have to train it up. I'm gonna probably do some off-screen training. Um, I just didn't want to do any because I wanted to like make it look like I like nothing happened. Like I, I was the exact same spot. But yeah, this is a completely different file because it's a completely different hard drive. But I'm gonna teach Bolt Seed to my C dot because I'm pretty sure it didn't, it didn't know it before. So yeah, see, I learned Bullet Seed. I'm probably gonna get rid of it soon. I'm just wanting, like, you know, just, just basically for the for this gym. So yeah, and like I d did for the first six parts of the walkthrough, um, I'm going to just, uh, just do this for all the trainer battles. Yeah, I'm gonna like hold on the space bar so I can like run really fast. Look at that, guys. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, you can you can do that with ROMs. Hold on the space bar and you can go really fast. But yeah, you can actually skip this gym. You can go like this. Well, not skip the gym, but skip, you know, the trainers. And yeah, just make it up here to Roxanne. But, I like to fight the trainers. That's why we're gonna go back. Yeah, that was awesome. Okay. Alright! It's time to fight this dude! Yeah, let's see what he's up to. Let's see what he has to offer. <gasps> Don't take us gym trainers lately! I'll show you where, why we're better! What? I have two Pokemon that are super, super effective. On both ground and rock types, which is the only Pokemon you're gonna see inside this gym, except for Roxanne's strongest Pokemon. So yeah, youngster Josh, and I think he has all Geodude. So yeah, we're just gonna use Bolt Seed. Look at that, two hits, done. Yeah. Oh wow, level 11. That's awesome. Geodude. I think I'm just gonna do what a nasty trainer does. I'm just gonna do this. Yeah, I'm just gonna switch back. I know, and he he did some he used some type of move, but he got a critical hit. And Zig Zagoon got to level 7, there we go. And you have another Judo, so we're just gonna do that again. Yeah, yeah. I'm not fighting this thing. No, there's no way. You can forget it. Guys, right? you can forget it. And seriously, this guy's trying to kill my C dot. Yeah, Zig Zagoon didn't get really anything for that fight. But you know what, that's okay. That's perfectly fine, perfectly normal. And look, he's another kid. Let's, let's fight him. Actually, you know what, let's skip him. Yeah, no, I'm just kidding. Yeah, yeah. If you can't beat me, you won't stand a chance against Roxanne! Really? Youngster Tommy. For some reason, I thought this was a Tony person. Why the heck are you in front of my party, C dot? I don't know. You look at three hits. Wow. 202. Holy crap. Yeah, yeah. Okay. 
we go heal very fast and spacebar still holds down. Well, yeah, I, I, I just don't want to, you know, you guys don't want to see this. So, yeah, I can't do this with Pokemon Platinum, sadly, because I am going to walk through that game. But whatever. So, yeah, let's, before you're in there, let's talk to this guy. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Get the shiny gym badge. You know, I'm going to get all, all gym badges. Seriously, what is this guy's problem? I don't know. Let's go back into the gym. Alright, guys. It's final time. Finally. To take on the gym leader. Yeah, actually, the part for the, for the last four gyms of the game, I'm probably just gonna fight all the trainers in one part, and then in the next part, I'm gonna fight the gym leader. But for the, you know, for the gyms, like the, for like for the, for the first few gyms that, that have really easy puzzles, I'm probably just gonna fight every trainer, including the gym leader, in the, uh, including the gym leader in the same, um, part. So, yeah. So, Cedar is in the front of my party. And I'm actually not gonna. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna use the space bar for this for this battle because you guys probably want to see it. So I'm actually gonna put Zigzagoon in front and then switch out to see uh, see that just so I can I don't know because I want to do that. Hello, I am Roxanne, the Respiro Pokemon Gym Leader. We all know that seriously. She just wants to tell us again because she thinks we're some type of idiot. Um. I became a gym leader so that I may apply what I learned to the Pokemon Trainer School. What the heck? Why the heck is Pokemon Trainer School capitalized? It's like, apply what I learned at the Pokemon Trainer School in battle. Like, would you, uh, would you kindly demonstrate how, how you battle and with which Pokemon? Seriously. Alright guys, it's finally time to take on the first gym leader. Haha, <laughs> I thought this would never happen. Just two. Why? I think she had three. Oh, wait a second. In Pokemon, um, uh, Pokemon Emerald, she has three Pokemon. I don't own Ruby and Sapphire. I only own, em I only own Emerald. So, she, yeah, in Pokemon Emerald, she has two Geodudes and a Nose Pass, but in this game, she has one Geodude. Well, four. I just see. Her Nose Pass is all 15, I think? Yeah, anyways, I'm not using, G uh, Zigzagoon because that'd just be stupid. Because I'm not stupid. Yeah. Well, I don't know. You know what? Forget it. Okay. Rock 2. Yeah, that's the TM you get from her, which is a pretty. Decent rock time move for this early in the game, really? What? Guys, I forgot something. I forgot to get potions! No! Okay, please survive it. Are you? Oh my gosh! I didn't e Do I have potions? Yeah. Oh yeah, I do. Okay. Wow. I didn't think I had any. Holy goodness. Wow. What's the mud gift? Long time to see. Actually, you know what? I got this mud gift this morning. <laughs> yeah, because it's not the same file. And look at that one hit KO. Wow. Mud gift is much stronger. Full Z Paul would have taken that thing out in probably two hits. And Zigzagoon got, got to level eight. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Nose pass. This UK. Wow. Uh, yeah. This is. Level 15, I want to tell you guys something before I continue, I know you guys don't like, I know you guys don't like to hear me talk, but, um, if you have, if you chose Traco or Mudkip, like, like, if you chose Mudkip like me, or if you chose Traco, you would have such an easy time against this gym. But, if you choose Torchic, the fire type, you are in for a rough, rough ride. Whenever I choose Tor Torchic, which is not very often, I've only chosen it a couple times, uh, I actually get to Combuskin because then it learns Double Cake, which can just annihilate annihilate this gym because fighting time moves are super effective on a rock types. So that's why I would consider like if you're gonna if you chose Torchic and you want to try to beat this gym, evolve it before you do that, okay? Evolve it into Combuskin, which evolves to level 16. So yeah, that's what I re would recommend. So we're gonna use Water Gun here and hold the one KO. That's what that's what I want. That's what I need. What? What? Oh, yeah, that's gonna make it all easier. Thanks a lot, Roxanne. You're an idiot. She obviously doesn't know that I'm making a walkthrough of this game. Well, fine. Let's keep using water gun, even though it's gonna do absolutely nothing. And, wow. Don't use Harden. You, yeah, use Rock, too. Won't do anything. Yes, it will. I forgot. Uh, I keep thinking about it because mud as a ground type. My speed fell. What? You don't usually do that until you get in the red. You're gonna use a potion? You're a gym leader. You should have a super potion. Seriously. Yeah, you can't. Nose passes are super rare to get, guys. Nose passes are just wow. They're just like, ah! They're very tough. 
to get. And it almost has to be. And hopefully you won't have one hit. And yeah, and hopefully you won't do that either. Seriously, Roxanne, what is your problem? Gym leaders, like most gym leaders, only heal up the Pokemon. Yes! Oh, am I right into that? Wow, that was, besides getting my C dot, like, getting, like, killed, that was really easy. And look at that, we're level 15, so we have one level to go until we become marched on. Bide! Are you kidding? You're not scared of Growl. I don't, Bide is much better than Growl, but I, I'm not a fan of Bide, but I will use it if I need it, so yeah. Done. Yeah, yeah. We defeat the leader Roxanne! Oh. Hallelujah! 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 Yeah, yeah! Okay. Done. So, I lost. It seems that I still have much more to learn. I understand the Pokemon League's rule states that the trainers are given this if they defeat a gym leader. Just look at it. Look, just look, watch this. That trainers are to be given this. If they defeat a gym leader, like why do you capitalize like all the important stuff, really? And you can watch a rematch later on, and she has like Golem and Onyx, and then she can eventually get Steelix, and then she has Aerodactyl. She has no, she, she has Probopass. No, I'm kidding. She doesn't have Probopass because Probopass wasn't even invented in the game. But yeah, please accept official po Please accept, please accept this official Pokemon League Stone Badge. Yeah, it's capitalized. Fifteen hundred. Yeah. Jake, you just received so much from the rock saying, yeah, yeah. Ooh! The stone badge hanging with the tank power of the Pokemon. I'm almost in this. I don't care. Team 39, that is Rock Tomb. Team 39, very, very, I don't know, it's a rock tomb. I don't think I have Pokemon to learn it, sadly enough. Thank you, Roxanne. It taught me nothing. Yeah, okay. So that's it, guys. For this gym. Whoa! What a great. Breathtaking. You know what? I, I should have talked to him before. Why didn't I? Oh, so now he thinks I can take on the champion, even though I still have seven badges to get. That's it, guys. This part of my Pokemon Ruby walkthrough. I'm so glad it's not finished, but I'm gonna go take some laps. Yeah. Alright, done. Alright, thanks, guys. And stay tuned for the next part, which will be part eight. We're gonna go, I guess, make our way to. I don't know. Uh, we're gonna run into Team Eggman with guys. So, yeah, thanks, guys, and thank you. Stay tuned for, for more videos. Bye-bye.